What's up, YouTube? So today I'm going to show you the, some of the things that I bring in my gym bag and why you should consider bringing them with you to the gym. So, number one, squat shoes. They help you with the squats. Not much more to say about them. Number two, foam rollers. Not a lot of people utilize these, but foam rollers are really useful in the gym. Especially when, like, when you're sitting all day in class or you're hit, basically if you have a tight back or tight hips, foam rolling before squatting or deadlifting can really help you out. Next, a lifting belt. Now lifting belts really help you with your compound movements, squats, deadlift, even benching because they help you they help you brace your core because they give your, your core something to push against. So I'm going to show you for example, put it on right here. You just take it, latch it up like that, and then when you're about to go lift, just like that. And then See, I have a lever belt, so you can get a prong one too. The lever one's just kind of fancy because when you're done, pop it off, take it off, you're good. Next one on the list. Oh yeah, by the way, if you're going to use the Inzer belt, make sure you have a screwdriver because you need a screwdriver to change the belt. Because sometimes you'll come in, say you're cutting, it'll be a little too big. Say you're bulking, you have to bump it up a notch. So make sure you have a screwdriver. Next one. Versigrips. Versigrips really help on cold days. What they do is, here, come here. Come on in, come on in. So you put it on like that, wrap it around. It's kind of like a lifting strap, but in my opinion, it's a lot better. Because you don't get that big old strap, you don't have to do all that twisting around the bar. All you gotta do is, wrap it around the bar, see the bar's like right here. You wrap it around like that, and you're good. Help with pull days, and it makes it really easy to have a thumbless grip. So you can really focus on pulling through the bag. Next on the list, we have wrist wraps. Wrist wraps really help, well, your wrist. When you're doing pushing movements, when you're doing heavy benching, heavy shoulder pressing, stuff like that, dips, these really help. If you feel your wrist hurting, you may need to start using these. These will really help your wrist, especially when you're going heavy. You gotta protect your wrist. If you don't, if you don't have healthy wrist. You can't do any benching. You can't do any overhead pressing. None of that. All right. Next. Obviously, you're gonna need some spare headphones because we've all been to the gym and forgot some headphones. So you're gonna need some spare headphones, earbuds, just in case. All right. Next on the list. Now, a lot of people don't know about this, but this is Liquid Chalk by My Protein. There's uh, there's a few other brands that make it, but My Protein is the one I've used and it works. So. You know, we all have gyms that don't allow chalk, and some may not even allow this, but my gym's fine with it. So it's really handy, because if your gym doesn't have chalk, this comes in clutch. Here, watch this. You just put it on your hand like lotion, just like that. Just like, it even looks like lotion. Just rub it on up like that. Between your fingers, make sure you get that good grip. And then, you got all over your hands. Doesn't look like much right now, but you just want it to dry. This one, wave your hands like this, or you can just wait and do nothing, really. It'll dry up eventually. All right, so now you see, it's been about a minute. I've been waving my hand, kind of letting that uh, liquid chalk dry. And look at it. It looks like chalk, and trust me, it works just as well as chalk, too. Now, that's all that. Finally, the last thing I advise, deodorant. Because you may, you may have that nice, solid pump, you leave the gym, you go to Chipotle, pick up your post-workout meal, and everybody's gonna be looking at you like, dang man, look at that pump, that guy's jacked. But he's staying. Don't be that guy. Don't be that guy in Chipotle coming in at lunch hour. It's so crowded, everyone's checking out your, your, your gains, mining your gains, and you stink. Don't stink, bring deodorant. I hate that, I hate that. I see people leave the gym, I've smelt people leave the gym, because they don't use this item. Bring deodorant, please. Don't stink up the gym. Don't stink up Chipotle or wherever you go for your post-workout meal. Anyway, so that's all my gym stuff. I hope you learn from this. Maybe grab some of this. Grab an belt, foam roller, whatever you don't already use. Grab it. Try it out. Let me know how it works. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Have a nice day.